Stark Auto Sales. Hundreds of insurance claim vehicles auctioned every week. Now with locations in Toronto, Montreal, and Ottawa. Parts cars, rebuildable wrecks, damage-free theft recoveries. Bid in person, bid online from anywhere. Worldwide shipping. A better way to buy a car. Visit StarkAutoSales.com. So this is... Hey everybody, uh, my name is Dan Lenahan. I'm a local uh, street artist down here in Key West, Florida on Duval Street. Uh, most recently, uh, I spent 450 hours sharpening my van with Sharpie Magic Markers. Uh, the black, gold, and silver version has been a big hit. But discreetly, for the last uh, three weeks, I've been adding color. And I don't believe yet that uh, anything's been posted on it. But I'm here with Rick Walker. He's got a TV show, the SST Car Show. So he asked if he can kind of interview me and kind of pan around the uh, van with the with the video and kind of so get your sense. Let's take a walk and uh, and we'll see what's going on. With that being said, let's take a look at the front hood, sir. Uh, you know, always the medallion on the car, but uh, this is my uh, creation of Adam with the hand shackled to the building. One of my pieces of art that I draw. I'm an ink artist, but more. If you take a look at the van here. Well, this is pretty crazy. Where did you get the inspiration to do this? Uh, you know, I did some plywood in Fort Myers, Florida about two years ago. And it came out, uh, you know, everybody thought it was wood burned in there. It was 40 feet by 8 feet. So the van was really a much smaller surface. But, uh, you know, it's the first time I ever tried something like this. So it's been, uh, it hasn't been easy. Sharpie's not an easy product to work with. However, the final product is amazing. So uh, all in all, you know, it was worth the effort. It's kind of a rolling business card, so to speak. And so this is kind of a cityscape. It's very 60s, you know, it's... Uh... Yeah, you know, I, I it went from a piece of uh, what I believe is uh, fine contemporary art to fine pop art just by adding the color. It's kind of got an Andy Warhol feel to it. And, uh, you know, best is, uh, you know, the reaction on the streets. Just everybody's really digging the color, especially the people who got to witness the black, gold, and silver for five months. So the, 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 the changing to color has just been a, a refreshing kind of... Uh, Thing for everybody who's got a chance to see it so I'm glad I did it you know 